Hi everyone, welcome to the third tutorial of Google Earth Engine. In the previous tutorial, I have shown you how to collect Landsat image with a specific data range with minimum cloud cover. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to visualize the collected image to the map. You will find the code in the description section of this video. Anyway, let's begin today's tutorial. First, uh, we will define visualization parameters. For that uh, variable, you uh, you need to write uh, these params. I mean visualization parameters. This code, B I S P A R A M S, and then bands. Uh, we know uh, the true color uh, for true color image we we have to use uh, band b4 b3 and b2 for true color image b4 b3 and b2 comma and then minimum and maximum we need to write uh, two range minimum and uh, maximum for better visualization of the image so initially uh, i have written for minimum uh, 1000 and maximum 6000 later we will change this as per requirement anyway and gamma uh, gamma 1.4 and then we have to uh, complete the code uh, using semicolon after the bracket so for uh, visualization parameters we have done and then uh, we will add the image to the map so for that we'll call map dot add layer this code and uh, then here uh, we have to uh, we have to include uh, the uh, collected image this one yes our collected image that i have shown in the previous video the variable name was uh, image or collected image and then of uh, these params visualization parameters yes this one and then And then I'm writing uh, image 2020. That means uh, I want my image in this name, in this title, and semicolon to complete the code. And after that, we want uh, we want center the map on the image location. So to do to do that, we'll call map dot center object. You have to write this code for center the map on the image location. Map dot center object, and then uh, we call our image that we have collected and eight. That means uh, the zoom level. You will find here several uh, code yep yeah and then uh, we have completed the code uh, using semicolon if you want to save this uh, code uh, save this uh, scripts then just click save and file name 
give a file name so i'm renaming this file image collection and uh, visualization that means i want to save this file in this name and after that click ok that means uh, later you can use this code use this script and after that uh, click on run you can see here the visualization is not uh, clear the image is not clear so we have to uh, change the uh, this range minimum and maximum so for that you can go to setting and here uh, you will see the range you can uh, write here the range the minimum range i have writing 7000 and maximum 10000 so you can see here this is not also uh, clear so i've changed the stress 90 percent and then apply you can see here now it is uh, pretty clear than before and the gamma uh, you can see here the gamma value uh, you can uh, select uh, on between 1.4 or 1.3 or You can see the image and uh, you can uh, now we can uh, write the range minimum and maximum and after that you can save again hope you enjoyed this tutorial practice uh, using my course and let me know if you face any issues anyway next tutorial will be about how to download landsat image using google earth engine and till then stay safe and stay happy